Welcome everyone to the next game. This one's called PBS Parents Play and Learn. Here's the opening logo. And, um, it's, it's feeding time at the zoo. Now also, just for a, um, just for a second here. And also, here's the, um, the, the, the title card for it, where you see the characters D and Del. Now I'm going to get to the game in the meantime. Just hang on a second. I'm sorry that my phone is wonky. It's uh, turned at a different angle. Well, we um, go to the screen here. Hold on. The way they show it is like this. That's why the camera, that's why you have to turn your phone like, like that. I know that, the, that does suck, but that's the way um, it is. For what is shown there. Just have to turn up the volume a bit. Okay. I'm sorry that the screen is cut off. So I'm going to have to move the camera a couple times. That way you can see everything on the screen. Now for the games here, we got um, Zoo, Kitchen. If you scroll like this with your finger, you can see like what there is here. The zoo, the kitchen, on a bus or train, bath time, in the garden, playtime, restaurant, playground, at a party, in town, grocery store, in the car, library, and the last one which is stickers. Just give me a minute here. Here's the first one at the zoo. Just hang on a second. And we'll get right to it. Just tap the screen like this. At the zoo. And here we go. You can tap the screen here to see the parents parent tips. And you can pause to read the words off to yourself to see what there is here. Find ways for fun. Develop your child's math and reading skills updated regularly. And there's the other option here too. This is the first time to see PBS Kids games on my channel here. And when you're done like reading what there is here, you can just tap the screen. Now, by going to parents' tips, this shows like what there is here on the screen. I'll move it closer like this so you can see. You can pause to read the words off to yourself to see what there is here. I'll just show this show this very quickly. And that's the basically the end. Then when you're done like reading the, the dialogue, just tap the arrow on the top of the screen here. Basically to go back. And press the play button to play. Play. It's feeding time at the zoo. The animals are hungry. Drag the food from the crates to feed the animals. The turtle wants to munch on five carrots. Now what you gotta do here is you wanna tap on the, the crate here. And you just want to give it to him. One. And on the top right hand corner screen basically shows your progress. Don't worry if, if what this game takes some time to get used to. Or any of the games. Two. Like you're trying to move your finger but it won't get into place. Three. I'll show the camera like this. I'll tilt it up like this so we can see the, how well I'm doing. Four. And one more to feed the turtle. Five. Thank you for feeding the turtle five crunchy carrots. Give the prairie dog four crunchy carrots. And just move your finger to the crate that shows the carrots. 
and to give to the prairie dog here. One, two, three. Now also on the top right hand corner screen basically shows the volume and the back button to go back. If you want the volume off or to go back. But I'm not going to worry about that. Four. Thank you for feeding the prairie dog four carrots. The monkey is very hungry. He wants six bananas. And you want to move the, your finger to the crate that shows the bananas and to give it to the monkey here. One. Two. And I'll tilt it up like this, that way you can see how well I'm doing. Just, three, just ignore those chimes they hear on my phone. Four. Also the screen, five, I know it's going to get kind of annoying with my finger in the way. I, I am sorry about that. And the screen will also show you like, not only just the number, but also the food that's next to it. Six. Thank you for feeding the monkey six tasty bananas. <laughs> Count the animals. Find the crate with the number that is the same as or equal to the number of animals. Which crate has the same number of fish as there are bears? Like here, you have to look very carefully on the screen here for what there is here. Like here, we see five bears and we want to give, tap on the screen for the correct number. You want to give, you want to, like here since there's five bears, you, you want to tap your finger to the box that shows number five. Fish with the number five. Feed each bear a fresh fish. And you want to move the, the fish here. One. To these bears. Two. Three. Four. And one more for this last one. Five. The five bears love their five delicious fish. <laughs> Which crate has the same number of bananas as there are bats? Like here is another one here, like there are six bats, <clears throat> and you basically need to give them, tap the screen that shows the, the six. You want to tap the screen, your finger to the, to the box that shows number six with the bananas. And you want give to them, give them to these bats here. Give each bat a banana. One, two, three. I don't know how many times I got to tilt the camera so you can see the whole screen. Four, five, six. The six bats are thrilled with their six yellow bananas. Which crate has the same number of carrots as there are prairie dogs? Like here, you never know what's going to show on the screen here. Like here, we need to, since there are six prairie dogs, you want to tap the screen that shows the the carrots with the number six and to give them to these prairie dogs. Give each prairie dog a carrot. One, two, three, four, five, six. Thank you for feeding the six prairie dogs six crunchy carrots. It's fun to feed the animals. Feed them as much food as you want. Tap on the animal when you have finished feeding him. The turtle can't wait to munch on the crunchy carrots. One, two, three, four, five, six, turtle. That's enough food for that animal. The prairie dog is crazy about carrots. Now, if you wonder what happens if you go back, tap the back button here. And by going back again, this also shows your progress on how well you're doing. Just hang on here just before I go here. So you can skip ahead comments in the meantime.
Like, you don't have to go on and on forever. Just do as many as you want for as much as you want. That's the end of this video. I'll see you next part for more of PBS Parents Play and Learn. Next one is the kitchen. I'll see you then. Bye.